Two police officers are in the hospital tonight, one in critical condition after a man opened fire during a traffic stop in Forest Park. Now, the man who fired the shots, Jacob Bailey, is dead. Forest Park police found his body not far from the scene on Jonesboro Road. Well, Fox News' Angelique Proctor has followed this developing story all day long and joins us now live. Angelique, why did the officers pull him over to begin with? Well, officers originally pulled this motorcyclist over for reckless driving right here on Mitchell Street. As you can imagine, with having two officers shot, this has been an emotional day for the Forest Park Police Department. It makes your heart sink. It is the kind of call that rattles the most veteran lawmen. Two officers shot while trying to pull over motorist Jacob Bailey for reckless driving. The traffic stopped happened on Mitchell Street in Forest Park. Police say it took a turn for the worst when Bailey got off of his bike and took off. As soon as they rounded the corner, uh, he opened fire on them. Uh, both officers were hit. One had uh, non-life-threatening uh, injury and um, the other one is, is currently in surgery. The officer involved shooting happened just yards from Forest Park Middle. The school was on level one lockdown and many parents rushed to the scene. He called me and then he sent me a, a Instagram, I love you. <laughs> and then we were like, we just got in her car and just came over here like, so I'm going to stand here until they let him out of school. Police found suspect Bailey dead behind a house on Mitchell Street. They are now trying to determine just how that happened. So it's possible your officer shot him? It's possible. It's possible either he did, he shot himself, or the officers. GBI moved in and took over the investigation while police from many agencies are grateful both officers survived. You know, to have two officers shot, that's... Uh, that really taxes on your emotions.